Hey guys, Ponce here on the public test room. I'm going to try and make this video real quick before the public test room dies on us, given that I have 2,500 ping, and it's not my connection. But in any case, here's the support and mage items uh, video I promised in the previous AD and tank one. Uh, so first off, Forbidden Idol has changed. That's gone uh, down in cost. It's now 700 gold instead of 750. Um, and items that build out of it have changed quite a bit. There's, of course, the Ardent Sensor, which is a completely new item. I made a video on that separately on its own, so if you want to uh, check that out, you can go um, check that video. But other than that, Morella Nomicon... Uh, let's just actually move around. Uh, Morella Nomicon has gone up in AP a little bit by 5, and has gone down a little bit in MP5, down to 10. So it w I got uh, reduced from, I believe, 12 to 10. And uh, other than that... Mikhail's Crucible, that's uh, slightly different. Uh, Mikhail's Crucible now builds out of the Forbidden Idol, and the uh, cost has been increased to 2,450 from 1,600, and the Mana Regeneration uh, has been increased to 20 from 10. Uh, cooldown Reduction increased to 10%, so it actually has Cooldown Reduction on it now. So yeah, that's the item there. Um, aside from that, sim of a similar type of item, uh, Athene's Unholy Grail has been sort of nerfed. Uh, let's look at the numbers here. It's gone down to 25 magic resist from 40, so it doesn't give as much magic resist now. The only thing that still gives 40 magic resist from building out of the Chalice of Harmony is now the, the Crucible. So they wanted, I guess, this to be the defensive option and this to be the clear-cut offensive option. Um, and the mana regen has been reduced to 10 from 15, the flat, you know, baseline mana regen. And... Uh, the, uh, when you kill someone or get an assist, that's been the mana restore has been increased to 15 from 12 percent. So yeah, th it's um, basically right splitting this into a very clear cut. This is the offensive option. This is the defensive option. So yeah, there's that. Um, aside from that, the other change to uh, supporty magey type items. Well, this is just a pure support item, but a locket of the Iron Solari. The active now goes off the um, the level of the person you are casting the shield on. It's not your level anymore. So if you're a lower level support who's kind of fallen behind, uh, Lock of the Iron Cellar is still going to give a big shield to someone who has a solo lane and a snowballing kind of thing because they're a higher level. So um, yeah, that's the uh, support and mage item changes. Hope you find that informative. If you want a list of the actual, um, you know, the actual full list, you can look at it at your own pace and to see the riot reasonings behind this aside from just kind of me talking about the reasonings uh, the link will be in the description below so just click that to take you to the right post on their main page somewhere so yeah thanks for watching guys and uh, I'm gonna figure out what to do next goodbye